people! Welcome to my channel! We are now in my closet and this is not a closet tour video. <laughs> so if you're new here, thank you for clicking on this video and maybe if you have the time, you can check out my past videos and while you're at it, please hit like and subscribe. So these past few months, we have just been quarantining at home for obvious reasons. We haven't been going to the mall, we haven't been shopping, or kahit na online shopping, siguro mas minimal lang kasi we have more essential things to spend on. And that is very much understandable. But that is not a reason not to be stylish, right? So these past few months, I have found ways to revamp my style using the classic pieces I found in my closet. And on today's video, I'm gonna show you just how I did it. The first item on the list is an essential piece in every woman's closet. The quintessential white button-down shirt is a tried-and-true basic that can easily give you an efforty chic look. There are so many variations to this that you can choose based on your personal taste and how comfortable it feels on your body type. Some like it with a looser fit, while others prefer a more flattering thing to it. You can never go wrong with this classic look. Your white button-down shirt, crisp. Also, your brown belt and your straight jeans and white pumps. And if I want to make it a little casual, I can just throw on my ballet flats and make it work. I would probably use it to go to an important meeting and make a good impression. Or I can just, you know, go to a museum or have lunch and still look chic. So if you want to go a little sporty or probably casual chic, you can pair your crop top and your biker shorts with your favorite button-down shirt. For me, it has to be a little oversized for it to work. You can also pair it with your jogger pants. So it's simple, it's casual, it's very comfortable. I would use this to probably just take a walk or walk my dog or grab some coffee or probably go to the grocery store and do my groceries. Or if you want to work out or if you need to work out but you need to do um, your errands first, you can already wear your workout clothes and probably throw on your oversized button-down shirt to make it a little chic to do your errands. Like it? <laughs> it strikes a balance between looking casual and polished. I personally love how timeless and versatile it is. Or you can just wear it on its own with your favorite belt bag or just a good belt or your favorite shoes. And these heels are one of my favorites. They're from Louboutin. They're just sexy and we can just pretend that this is my boyfriend's button-down shirt. Sexy, right? <laughs> Once you find the perfect button-down shirt, I guarantee you will have tons of fun dressing up with this reliable wardrobe staple. The humble pair of jeans you have can go a long way in your wardrobe. No matter the season, it never gets old. Jeans come in various colors, washes, fabrics, and styles. With so many cuts and types to choose from, you can easily mix and match with what you have in your closet. This is another way to wear your scarf. So this is my Hermes scarf. I paired it with my straight jeans and my Bottega sandals. This look, I have to say, is very 90. I was a kid, I was a pop star, I was a supermodel, and I've always wanted to wear it myself. And now, I'm so proud of it, so I'm glad I can wear it again. They go with everything, and you can easily dress up or dress down your outfit with this. You can grab your mom jeans and pair it with your fun and playful top. This one has strings here, it's a crop top, and it looks so playful. Plus the color is also very playful. Again, it's very 90s. Or you can create a more elevated look by pairing your mom jeans with a crop top. This is a knit um, crop top and also this is a khaki blazer with my Balenciaga boots. I would probably wear this when I would travel, probably during spring or probably when I want to 
go to Paris or New York because these boots are really, actually, they're really comfortable. They look uncomfortable, pero hindi. Denim jeans is a versatile option for every occasion. You may have been wearing it your whole life, but there are still so many ways you can play with it. White t-shirt, the most basic of them all, but that's a good thing. It's simple, easy, and clean to look at. The white tee is a universal fashion staple, regardless of your gender or personal style. On lazy days, this is easily my go-to item as it delivers simplicity and comfort. White tees are more vulnerable to stain and wear and tear, but having a couple of these is an economical way to fill in the style gaps in your wardrobe without spending too much. So this is my go-to white shirt because it's very comfortable, it's made of cotton, it's really breathable. So kahit na mainit sa Pilipinas, you can actually be comfortable wearing it. You can wear it with your leather skirt. And this look can go from day to night. You can put on your sneakers or your heels and you can go on a date with this look. And it looks so chic. Or you can also create this cool girl look by pairing your white top with your Carl Jan Cruz jeans or any patchy jeans that you have. Shout out to Carl Jan Cruz for these beautiful jeans and also my pinstriped blazer. Probably I can use this every day since I want very comfortable clothes where I can move in. If you've seen my Instagram account, you'd know that I always, always wear white sneakers. So I like outfits that match my white sneakers. Think of it as your blank canvas. When you have a clean slate, it is easier to add more color or elements and build your outfit. Or you can go a bit formal. Yes, you heard it right. You can go a bit formal with your white t-shirt if you pair it with your sequin skirt and your pumps. Over the decades, it has been revamped and reinterpreted in so many ways. But at its core, the white shirt has an understated power to make her look come together. The next item is widely associated to a professional environment. But through the years, blazers have evolved from a mere office essential to a more everyday staple. It's a fashionable and functional transition piece suited for both business and pleasure. This is also a must in my luggage whenever I fly abroad. If you've seen my past travel photos, I like to spice up my OOTDs with different types of blazers that matches the weather. So you can wear your blazer in a more casual manner by wearing it on its own, throwing a belt, or probably it has a belt already, and just wear your Doc Martens. Or military boots, if you have any. It's comfortable, it's not that formal, and yet it's so chic. <laughs> and you can wear your pastel cohorts and make it a little more fun with your crop top and your white sneakers. Well, actually, I wear this all the time. Like, it's business here and then party here. <laughs> Go for an oversized or boxy style blazer if you're aiming for a more relaxed look. But if you want to look sharp, you can opt to wear a more form-fitting suit. Or you can pair your blazer with your silk dress to make it a little less feminine. So I would wear this to probably weddings in Tagaytay since it gets a little cold there or Baguio. Or probably to a date at night to go to a dinner. It makes me feel feminine at the same time empowered. Invest in quality blazers and witness how this piece can give mileage to your wardrobe. The last item that I'm showing you is such an important wardrobe staple. It's no other than the Timeless Little Black Dress, or LBD. Its iconic status can be traced back to Coco Chanel in the 1920s. And of course, who could forget Audrey Hepburn and Breakfast at Tiffany's? 
Hollywood has also fallen in love with this versatile dress which launched this garment into a bit of a cult favorite in the world of fashion. Its history may sound glitzy, but trust me when I say that LBDs are also perfect for everyday wear. It just works for any occasion. So the easiest way to style your strapless LBD is to probably pair it with a belt. And of course, your classy gold and black sandals. This is definitely a date night look for me. you can wear your white turtleneck shirt underneath your LBD to create that 60s or 50s look. You can never go wrong and instantly look elegant and classy with the right LBD. This is why for decades, trends come and go, but the LBD never lost its charm and adaptability. So this is my most casual LBD look. You can throw on your leather jacket on top of your LBD. I think this is linen. And then I'm just wearing my slip-ons. I would probably wear this to get coffee on a Sunday or to walk my dog. are some of the fashion staples that can serve as a good foundation to your closet. The more basic the item is, the more work it has to do. But I believe it's more important to build your wardrobe based on your lifestyle and adjust them to fit your personal form and style. Yes, there are guides on how to wear this and that, but don't be afraid to experiment and discover new life into the tried and tested combinations. Make the outfit work for you, not the other way around. So there you have it. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and I hope I was able to, you know, inspire you to look into your closets again and probably find the things that you forgot about and, you know, have fun wearing them again. And I suggest you invest in the classics because they can last you a long time and I think they're good investments talaga. You can also pass it on to your kids if you treat them right and care for them right, you know. And trends come and go and I, I suggest you know, you think about the trends not being able to dictate the way you dress. You should have your own style and fashion is supposed to be fun. So it shouldn't give you anxiety. You should just go ahead and have fun with it. So again, thank you for watching this video. Do not forget to like and subscribe and don't forget, life is beautiful. Bye!